Hi, happy Friday. This is my what I eat in a day and my new who is she fucking gym workout, all right, my new routine, okay? Because honestly, this this is going to sound wild, all right, but joining the gym has given me a new lease of life, all right? I feel stronger. I've, I've literally only been there, what, just over a week now and I just feel great. Honestly, I feel so mentally great, physically great and yeah, I, I just, you know, thought I'd show you what I'm doing. So this is the gym that we joined. This is Steve showing me uh, how to work on my form and like the correct form because you'll see in a second I am shit at this. So yeah, my chest is so weak, all right? My arms are like jelly. I've got no control, which you'll see in a second. So I always worry that I'm going to fall off that bench. So I have to really think about it when I'm like laying down. But look at my arms, like they're so bad. So yeah, I'm a bit out of breath anyway. I've just run up the stairs. I'm not quite there yet. I'll... Stamina is terrible. Okay, I ain't, you know, I ain't fully there. But yeah, this uh oh look, he's so helpful, honestly. Like he just gives me so much good advice. So yeah, he's coming to save the day and help me out. So yeah, he did say as well, which you'll see, to try a lower weight. Because I always go in like I'm fucking, you know pumped and like rrr. and he's like no calm down <laughs> like you can't go in at 35 kg babes all right so yeah I'm trying to lower one here just to practice my form because obviously I don't want to like cause injury I don't want to do anything uh you know wrong I want to make sure I'm doing it right so yeah he said just try a lower weight to you know practice a little bit better literally going all the time though like I'm having rest days from like strength training but I'm doing cardio on those days off. So, yeah. And as you know, I'm doing a four-week weigh-in video. And, you know, there's been results just from this short amount of time. So, yeah, I'm so excited, honestly, to just continue it. And did you hear my toe crack then? You know, just... He was telling me here as well, like, my feet come up. So he was saying, like, keep your feet firm on the ground. Because, like, my feet are all over the place. I love this one. This is the lateral... Oh, someone's mowing the fucking lawn. Do you know what? I think it's Steve. <laughs> Steve said he was going to mow the lawn. Anyway, um, yeah, I love this one. So this is the lateral pull down, pull down thingy, my bob. So yeah, this, I really like this. And, uh, you know, I think I'm okay at doing this. So yeah, this is me having a drink. This is me thinking about life. So yeah, this is what I mean. Look, I upped it because I think I'm fucking... Who is she? You know, look at the face. Look at the face on it. <laughs> this is Steve doing uh, whatever he does. This is me doing the back. Um, yeah, I quite like this one. So you can like turn this machine, you know, from doing the pull down thing to like the back, like with different attachments and stuff. But yeah, honestly, going to do cardio on the days I'm not doing um, weights, you know, I feel so much more motivated. I feel great within myself, you know. It's just... Yeah, I look forward to it. So this is me attempting to do this, but I'm just not that strong. So yeah, I said, let me have a go. Like, I want to do it. And to be honest, I was really put off by the big fucking bulge in my face. So its penis was far too close to my head. So <laughs> it was just making me laugh. So yeah, I couldn't have taken this one seriously at all. But yeah, and then, like, he was showing me, like, oh, we can do squats with this because I'm terrible at the squat rack as well. So I will do another video when I do, like, um, you know, my legs and lower stuff. Look at the fucking muscles. I'm joking. But, yeah, like, I can't put the squat rack on my back. You'll see. So, yeah, sometimes, like, I film just to see my form as well. So I've got so many, like, videos. But the rower, I literally about fell over when I got up off this. It makes my, my, my jegs, like, lelly is what I was going to say. My legs, like, jelly. But yeah, I love it. I love the treadmill. I love the row off. So like I said, I do these on days that I'm not doing weights and it just keeps me motivated because I know I'm going every day. And yeah, I mean, I have had a couple of days off, but we've literally timed it where like nobody goes in. So we have for about an hour, we have the gym to ourselves, which is great. So then I can practice my form and stuff. But yeah, this is like what I do at the end. So I just blast the treadmill on like 10 incline and get a right sweat on. Sometimes I even fucking run. All right, I even run. So <laughs> You know, my arms are a bit all over the place when I run. I sort of like don't know what to do with them.
I just got these from Tesco, right? They're on the reduced. They're plant chef meat free spit bolognese, which we're gonna have on a jacket potato one day. But tonight we're all having because I took out two packs of chicken. Uh, that's the fuck, I forgot cottage cheese. We're having sweet potato tonight with chicken breast in like a Nando sauce with vegetables and a sweet potato and cottage, cottage pie. <laughs> Fucking cottage pie, cottage cheese. But yeah, just got these in um, Tesco as well. Protein thin bagels. So I'm gonna have egg, avocado, and one of these protein bagels. So I do usually have this sourdough bread, which I love at the minute, and baby spinach as well, and an avocado. So that's what we're having for breakfast anyway, but yeah, like I said, I've had my banana. I've got to take my supplements as well. So I actually really need to stock them up because I'm running out on stuff. But yeah, I'll take them soon because I take two, like, well, the COQ10, I take 600 milligrams. One's in the morning and then one's later in the evening because they can't absorb like that much all together. So you have to have them at like separate times. But yeah, that's what I'm going to say anyway. Well, for breakfast, so. Oh no. You twist it, Faye. Faye, Faye, no, that's not how you do it. Come here. Where? Baby, you've messed it all. Not that bad. Twist. Ooh! I still would have done it. Yeah, in the messiest way possible. It's not about how it looks, it's how it tastes. I thought you keep telling me. <laughs> <laughs> this avocado's hollow. Look. It was like really hollow. Yeah, it's really took the bit out. The middle out. Hello, Dingo. Let's go. Hiya. I've got to stop saying that. I've had respect for that. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to stop saying it. I have to like really control myself out in public. I can do that. Yeah, everywhere. I've got to. Can I get all you are in kitchen? <laughs> Can I get all you are in kitchen window? <laughs> Can I have a bit of extra virgin olive oil? <laughs> you can. Do you want the seasoned one? Yeah, absolutely or the blind not. one? Okay. Well, you can put it in. It's got bay leaves and stuff. My lovely. Let that heat up. Uh, have we got enough for me to have four eggs? Uh, yeah. This is Mason's. Um, the window. I won't get your titties in, don't worry. This was his little story. Once upon a time, once upon a time, bless him, there was a massive fart that would chase everyone around and if it caught up to you, it would make you sniff it all up and it would make you faint on the spot. This is Mason's handwriting practice. But one day, someone named Mason came to save the day. Mason was 11, cool. <laughs> funny but at the end of the day he became a wonderful beautiful hero you are probably thinking how is an 11 year old boy going to stop a giant fart i don't actually know maybe with a massive blow of air i'm going to breathe in a lot and blow it out into the universe oh totally fucked up my eggs it's got um avocado uh, two eggs, spinach, and chicken slices, and then a bit of salt and pepper. Forgot to show as well that I had a cheese string and this dunker, so. Um, yeah, and I, this was my bath before I went to sleep for a few hours, which was much needed because we this is where we go for our day date. So, incoming, me bouncing like a right cunt, all right? <laughs> this is me and my element. Bear in mind, there's no other adults, all right? It's just me. Well, no, there was actually, to be fair. But, yeah, we have so much fun. They blast the music. Um, you know, <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> but, yeah, this is Faye in the wild, all right? This is, honestly, it's so much fun. This is Steve. <laughs> It just makes me laugh how he's running. But yeah, we have so much fun, so. I'm shattered now, you know. I've still got a bit of battery left, you know. I had a bit of a sleep earlier, so after the gym, I come home and had a bit of a sleep. So, because we've started doing this thing where we go to the trampoline park, as like a day date, me and Steve, once a week. It's either on a Thursday or Friday. It's nice just to have some time together. And we had a grenade bar as well, so I forgot to like show that, but in the car, we had a grenade bar, which is like, 20.1 grams of protein so they're really good i'm actually going to bulk buy some 
uh, on the actual grenade website they're a lot cheaper so i'm just about to prepare dinner because i've got gcse option evening tonight so that is like the final thing of the day and then i can just relax is dragon's den still on i don't know if it is i'm gonna watch dragon's den and eastenders i'm so annoyed at eastenders like the whole whitney and oh it's, yeah so frustrating but um yeah the boys are having jacket potatoes because they won't eat although i only got these the other day and they've got a few little sprouts on but they won't eat the sweet potato they're just yeah they're like i'm not eating that so me and steve have got sweet potato which i'm gonna wash i'm gonna get these done now all the potatoes because they take forever so i'm literally just gonna put um a little bit of olive oil so it's a nando's peri peri quick marinade so we're all having that tonight so i've got four chicken breasts out and um yeah, it says flavour in 30 minutes. So I'm going to make a salad as well. I've got like lettuce, olives, tomatoes, sweet corn, you know, whatever's in the fridge. So yeah, that is my plan. But I'm going to get these potatoes in anyway. So at least they're just like, I could just warm them up later. The chicken I'm going to prepare and then cook that later. I'll make my salad and it's literally just a case of sticking the chicken on and then putting it together. So yeah, that's what I'm doing now anyway. But yeah, so far, I've had my banana, um... A protein bagel this morning a cheese string I do like a cheese string a dunker my grenade bar and then my dinner so that's like literally me i'm feeling like fuller as well because i'm eating more protein and like protein keeps you fuller for longer <laughs> who is chef when i'm saying it i'm like what but you know I'm, yeah like trying to you know i feel good though like all of these changes you know i, I do feel really good and um yeah, I'm going to go to the gym tomorrow. I didn't do legs today at the gym because I did legs the other day and I'm kind of doing like upper and lower. I don't know. I'm just, do you know what I mean? Like I worked on like my top half today. So yeah. Anyway, I'm going to prepare dinner and then I'll show you it when it's all done. But yeah, I might grab an hour as well before I go to this um, GCSE op what? options evening. We're tired. I'm going to put on a bit of slap as well. Fucking hell. I'll rock up at school like this. Oh, yeah. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> like that. Yeah, bless him. Sorry, he's got to pick his options soon. I can't believe it. You know, when I think about that, I'm like, how have I got a child that's about to, like, pick their options for GCSE? I don't know if he's been feeling it a bit this week as well. So I am planning a McDonald's date night with the kids this weekend, I think so just um yeah go for a nice evening drive to mcdonald's i think you know but um yeah anyway i i'm gonna pre pre prepare my potatoes i'm gonna get an hour's sleep as well but yeah marinate my chicken and whatnot but i'll show you it all anyway this is what i'm using the nando's peri peri quick marinade so i'm gonna pop some of that on and I'm also going to stick on this air fry seasoning, which is about 69p from B&M. Stick a load of that in. I'm going to pop some salt in. And then pepper, but obviously I can't do that one-handed. So, <laughs> yeah, I'll do that in a minute, but I'm just going to everywhere a good rub but yeah i'm literally just gonna pop this in the fridge for a few hours once it's all fully covered like so i'm gonna put some cling film over it and then yeah leave it in for a few hours and just cook them last minute but the potatoes they take ages don't they this stuff smells really nice here yeah, this was from tesco i think it was like 150 on the club card so there's different like strengths as well so obviously this one's a medium but yeah look at that color so yeah, that's what I'm going to do anyway. I'll show you when it's all cooked. But in the meantime, I'm going to go to bed for a little bit. And then, because um, I feel like I've been on the go, like, non-stop. Um, had a little bit of sleep early, but I just... Do you know what I mean? I'm just trying to get it where I can at the minute. But, yeah, I'll show you it all later anyway. So. I've just got back from options evening. So Tyler kind of knows what he wants to pick now for his GCSEs. Bless him. So, yeah, it was really interesting, actually, like, learning more about the courses and stuff. And I've just come home and served dinner up, so I'll show you what we've got tonight. But yeah, this is just my what I eat in a day. 
in my new workout routine. So yeah, I'd appreciate if you know you like this video and subscribe and all that jazz. I don't know. But yeah, I am gonna have my dinner and then just unwind. I've got a Coke Zero. I've got a Whitby bra off. It's doing me a in now. Put bra on for the school. All right. Hang on. There we go. Oh, I feel free. But yeah, put bra on for the school, didn't I? You know. But um, I'll show you dinner anyway. So yeah, like I said, you know, this is just my day of, you know, what I've filled my face with really. I overdid the eggs. So you know where they go a little bit gray, but they're still edible. So <laughs> yeah, I did some boiled eggs, but we've got the um, marinated chicken. Obviously it weren't marinated for too long. And obviously a bit of a mixed salad. It's just got olives, beetroot, onion, lettuce, tomatoes. I just put it in a hero's tub and shook it about a bit. So yeah. Looks a bit all over the place, doesn't it? But we've got cottage cheese, which I've just mixed in with some paprika, salt and pepper, and the grilled chicken. But yeah, that is my day um, of everything. So yeah, anyway, don't let any of the kids get you down. You're absolutely amazing. I love you and I'll see you in tomorrow's video.